Bom bum. Bom bum. Bom bum. Bom bum. It's quacky. It's taffy. It's quacky taffy. Bom bum bum bum. I have no clue what that was. Uh, anywho, it's quacky taffy. Back with another Minecraft episode. Today's episode is an episode of me trying. Um, it's an episode of me trying to finish. Well, not finish, but trying to continue this Chick fil A restaurant I've been building. Um, what we're going to do now is we're going to finish the outside. We're going to build the actual drive through itself. And then we're going to start building the walls. The, uh... Sorry. I had to do it. I had to do it to him. Okay? He's in my way. He was the one thing standing between me and pure victory. And so I eliminated him. Okay? Okay? Don't get mad at me because I'm great. Get mad at yourself for being not great. Um, let's see, let's see. We've got... Um... I don't know, it's hard to... I'm trying to guesstimate it because we have a, there's like a, it connects to this area. Oops. Could you not? Thank you. So basically what I'm saying is that from here all the way around here will be gray concrete and will be like table seating areas uh, stuff like that so then that means let's see um um I forget that I'm working with the limited space. So what we'll have to do is just cut that there. So we'll just make it, we'll make it too high. We'll have the tables here and chairs going sideways. Um, let me think. Yeah, yeah. Then we could have stairs going along here to go up. Regular walkway right here. Um, then the drive through can wrap around. We're probably going to need a significant amount of area. Oh, and there's tables right here too. They try to make the most of the space that we have because compared to other stores, it is a smaller store. We don't do as high numbers as the other stores in the area. And I may I, I was just about to say like what area I was in and then realized that I'm recording for a YouTube video where I probably wouldn't want you to know where I live. Probably. Duh, so I mean, technically speaking, some people that watch this video do know where I live because they know me personally, but, but, for the people that don't know me, I don't want you to know me, if that makes sense. Okay, okay. Then we'll just have this line continue all the way over to here. We'll have this be like a pathway, and then there's going to be stairs right here. Stairs or slabs might work, actually, now that I think about it. Okay, okay. Sorry, it's very hard to recreate something.
that has so many intricate details, especially by memory, and trying to make it fit with the size that I've made this place. Uh oh. Wait a minute. Oh, dang it. I can feel the sneeze. I feel a sneeze coming on. I, I, I. Oh, it's like right on the tip of my nose. That freaking sucks. Now I want to sneeze and it's gone. Okay, okay. So that looks good. That looks good. Um. Let me see. So we need this. This. That's what we need. Okay. Go ahead and... Okay, that looks good to me. Now it's time to build the actual... Uh, car area so let's see we've got we've got the you know what we probably could get away with uh, doing another thing right here yeah I'd say we can what I'm looking at right now since the car themselves are going to be two blocks hmm let me think for a second we're gonna need huh let's see What we're gonna need is we're gonna need the thing in between. So basically what we have is we have, just for explanatory purposes, we have this right here, which is the first car entrance. And then we have the middle part. And then we have the other car entrance. So we have this, the sign of like, you know, on fast food restaurants where it has the sign that shows how much food is, uh, what you can order, stuff like that. That's what this middle part is going to be used for. Um, let's see here. So now I guess we'll just continue it all the way to here. Um, we'll connect the white to the brick. Okay, so we got the white. That continues all the way to here. Then I'll connect it with this, and then I'll put one right here. Now looks good to me. Okay, we'll connect this road. This, yeah, I call it road. Could call it pavement, I guess. Yeah, I'll connect the pavement right here. Uh, but pavement sounds like a sidewalk. But a sidewalk is a sidewalk. I'm really about to look up the definition of a pavement. Okay, yeah. So then what we're going to also have to build is a canopy area overhead. Um, shoot, I don't really know what it looks like, to be honest, now that I think about it. Poop. Um, uh oh. That could be a slight problem if I don't know what it looks like. Um, uh, let me think. Let me think. Huh. Okay, if that's the case, we will... 
this will be the outer part of the uh, thingy thingy because think of it this way think of how uh how hot it gets in the summer and imagine being out there taking orders like that's what it used to have to be like how many far apart are these four one two three four one two three four one two three four Huh. Huh. I mean, I. Hmm. I think it works. We can make it work. If it doesn't work now, then we can make it work. How about that? And then the, uh. We'll start. We'll start it right there. Let's see, we'll do this. We'll do one, two, three, four. And we'll start it right there. Right? Yeah. And then, let's see. Then we'll have the other part right here. Where is the midway point? If there's one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Um, um, okay, that's a good enough midway point. Um, 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 um. Doing this by memory really is not serving me well at all. Okay, okay. Then what we'll do is we'll keep this going all the way this way. But first, what we need to do is we need to estimate it again. One, two, three, four. Then you got the one block. One, two, three, four. Then you got one block. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. If you get where I'm going with this, one, two, three, four. If you don't, you're stupid. Then go ahead and uh, one, two, three, four. Uh, I'm thinking. Huh. Oh, that's a little poopy, isn't it? Shoot. Because if I have... If I have one, two, three, four, then... Uh, no, no, no. It works out. It works out. Yeah. It works out. Don't worry. Because then you have one, two, three, four. Blank. One, two, three, four. Blank one two three four blank one two three four blank one two three four one two three four one two three four and this is the actual drive through area itself okay if oh, I can't remember what okay that's middle aisle. That's this. This is the front of house. Uh, let me think. That's the front. This would be the actual drive through window. It's not really anatomically correct, per se. But you, you kind of get the general gist of what I'm going for here. Okay, so then we, wait, I can just build on top of it. I don't know why I dug into the ground. So then this will be the barrier. Um, let's check how this looks. This is, all in all, this is pretty decent, but I think I may have made the store itself a little bit too small maybe. 
Um, also, I do hope that this mic quality is working better. I have raised... I, I moved the microphone itself away from my mouth. But didn't didn't think about the fact that the fact that I moved the mic further away from my mouth because what was happening is every time I would say like a P word like poopy 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 butthole poopy it would sound like this poopy 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 butthole so all you would hear is the uh all you would hear is me just poo 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 like breathing into the microphone really loud which was not working for me at all. So I moved the microphone away from me, but didn't think to remember the fact that I also would be limiting the amount of sound that reaches the microphone. So I raised the volume of my microphone. So hopefully, once I go back to this recording, it will be A-OK -okay and it will look much better. Sound, not really look. And then this is a merging area, so you can merge into the oncoming. So then it forms one line instead of like a car with two lines. But the whole key purpose of this is that cars can be on the side waiting for their food. But then any cars that have like a small order, like, oh, I just want a sandwich and a medium fry. Instead of someone who wants like five deluxes and eight small fries or something like that. We can have that one person with the sandwich and the medium fry go ahead and pull to the side so they can exit the Chick-fil-A parking lot. So they will sit there in the line waiting to leave even though they've already gotten their food. You know? It, it makes sense. It makes sense. Also, um, what this is, this is just a walkway. So you don't have to walk towards the road to get all the way in. Cause what what happens is you have people you have people that sit out there and take orders, right? But then you have someone outside of the window next to the cars, either walking them that way, taking food, all that kind of stuff, pulling people forward. So to get to that point, since it's only a window, they have to exit through here, go all the way around, all the way through there, all the way through there. All the way through there and then all the way to the window right there this is why I say that uh, I don't know if you guys have ever seen it before but it's drive throughs but instead of a window it's a door if I could look you whoever's watching this right now if I could look you in the eyes you would see how passionate I am about this idea it's such a good one because when you have huge orders that you can't physically put through a window like catering or something like that but you already have it ready usually people come in to get the catering but if you have like a big order you have to have them pulled to the side because you can't fit an order like that through the window itself so what I what I would provide for such as a solution for such a problem is a door you can walk in and out if someone's taking, like, what we have is we have one person on drinks and one person bagging all the food itself. Sometimes the drink person may get a little distracted and won't be making your drink. So if there was a door, instead of sitting there having to be like, hey, 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 Bob, hey, Bob, 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 I'm waiting on the drink for order uh, 87. Hey, hey, Bob. Bob, do you have that order order ready for 87? I'm waiting on just the small sweet tea, please, please. Bob, Bob, I see you over there. You could just hop over there, make it yourself real quick, and be simple as that. And the dotted line basically just means you can merge here and there in case you wanna cut off the other people on the side. Which you'd be surprised how many 
times that happened. Yeah. I'm not going to say how, mo how many times it happens, but just know that it happens an absurd amount. Like, there's been, there's been times where people have, like, um, shoot. Huh. Maybe Paula's Deep Slate? I guess that looks okay. Um, I don't know. Uh, thank you. I'm thinking, because maybe I could change this to a polished deep slate? Where is it? Where's the polished deep slate at? No, not netherite. Um, polished deep slate. Right here here so if I were to let's say okay um uh, sorry I mean, the actual Chick-fil-A itself doesn't look like this. I'm just taking creative liberties right now. <laughs> I'm doing creative things, okay? Just give me a second. Give me a second to show you my idea. Because basically, it didn't really look that good. The, uh... The dark block going straight into... I mean, I could have used, like, fence gates. But then I wanted it to be the same color as whatever I made the canopy area over there so what I'm thinking this may not be permanent I might just go right back and change it but what I'm thinking is that that looks good ish okay if I had the whole thing looking like that, that'd be fine. Yeah, that'd be fine. I'm cool with that. I mean, I have to change the whole thing, though. Oh. You know what? Okay, okay. What I what I want to what I want to do is basically just build the. It would look like this, basically. One, two, three. One, two, three. See? It would look like that. Just a small little canopy like that. Okay, you know what? This is the end of the episode. <laughs> I don't want to sit there and do that. I'm a little, little bored with this now. I've been thinking too hard on this. Okay, that's the end of the episode. Block of the episode is... Polish Deep Slate. So, shoe scat, steely dat, boop bop boop.